Hi guys, Stiggy at the Guitar Loft here, just another quick video. Um, last video I showed you basically the idea of filing off your fret ends, you know, smoothing them off and everything like that. Uh, what I didn't cover in that video, because I'm trying to keep these short and sweet, is, you know, fretboard maintenance and maybe if your frets are okay, they're just a little bit dull and you get all that grime in there as well. Uh, you remember our tool from last time, which is the piece of cardboard with just a slip put in it. Um, there are several ways that you can buff these up. You can tape up all the way down the neck if you want to, that's entirely up to you. Um, but to clean up the actual frets, uh, the fretboard itself you can buy oil for that. Actually you can even do lemon juice as well, which I'll cover in another video, just to clean off all the grime and the muck and everything. I'm lucky enough in here to have one of these, which is basically a Dremel, uh, a Dremel tool and you can buy these little buffing wheels as well. Um, now you can buy these buffing wheels on their own and you can actually fit them into a low powered battery powered drill so if you've got one of those in the garage already you don't need to buy a Dremel you just get one of these uh, and they're just like a little foam you know feltish pad which spins around and then cleans it around but you can use that to clean your fretboard if you go easy and you can use it to clean your frets as well if you haven't got that and you want to be a bit and you don't want to spend any money then here's the top tip I know someone's looking and saying 100 grit no right put your tool or should I say your jig on here your cardboard jig for your frets you can either rub wire wool up and down it which gives it a pretty nice mighty fine smooth finish okay um, I don't suggest a file or an emery board for this because it, it just takes off too much meat all you try to do is get some shine back and get some of the grit out of it but I'll tell you this did you know that the back of sandpaper yes the back of sandpaper has a grit as well and it's all it's you know I don't know how many per inch it is but it's very smooth but it does the job and what you can do take the back of the sandpaper let me reiterate that the back of the sandpaper right and you can rub and rub and rub it takes a little bit longer but you can actually see some of the shine coming through already now if you are lucky enough to have a Dremel tool like I am because I'm posh ha. then obviously excuse the noise guys put your tool on or use it on the drill and then just ever so, sl ever so slowly work your way over your fret okay now also what this is good for as well all right, if you go easy, but only if you've got one of these, don't do this with your papery sandpaper, otherwise you're just left with good old elbow grease, guys. But if you watch, you see all this crud and the rubbish and everything? Watch this fret. You're not putting any pressure on this, guys. Let me tell you, you're not. All you're trying to do is get rid of the stuff that polishing won't take away. Right, it also gives you a chance to get in there behind that fret where all that sweat and wear gets in as well. And you can polish your fret while you're at it as well. Okay. This is mainly only on a rosewood board, on a on a maple board or somewhere thin like that, then you wouldn't be bothering doing this. But can now can you see the difference? And if I've already done one. Oh look at them. <laughs> There's your dirty ones. Turn this off. There's your dirty ones. And there's your shiny ones, you see? And that just gets rid of all the crud and everything like that. No pressure, guys, just nice and easy. Like I said, if you haven't got one of these, I suggest you buy one of the, the wheels, right, and just use it on a normal battery-powered drill, because that, you know, chuck-powered drill, uh, and go easy and go steady, and that'll clean your fretboard off just nicely. Uh, other than that, if you haven't, make your tool up, Get the back of your sandpaper, rub it up and down your frets and it'll take all the nasty grime, rubbish and sweat and all sorts off. Alright guys, look after yourself. Speak soon.